recording and let's go directly to our transcription to finish it once and for all. One, two, three, let's go. That's great. So what do you have to wear? Well, what do you think of this? I don't know. Put it on. Let's see. Okay, fine. I like it. You look wonderful. Yeah, but it's very dressy. And these high heels are so uncomfortable. But you look, look great in those shoes. Um, you know, I don't think I want to wear a dress. Okay, uh... Well, how about a skirt? I like this one. Yeah? But it's really old. That's okay. Try it on uh, with this blouse and, hmm, these boots. That is the next segment. Okay. Okay. So, you know that. Okay. Let's continue with the next transcription, okay? Who can start? Hmm. Luis, let's start with you. Okay? Okay. You start. One, two, three, action. Heels are so uncomfortable. But you look great in those shoes. Um, you know, I don't think I want to wear a dress. Mm, you know, I don't think I mm -hmm. want, I want, to... I want to repeat. <laughs> Excellent. Repeat, uh, complete. Again. You. Ah, okay. You know, I don't think I want mm -hmm. to, huh? as, as I. <laughs> That's it in English. In English, that's it. That's it. Okay, no problem. Let's pass to the next. No, I don't think I want to wear a dress. I don't think I want to 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 wear a dress. To wear a okay. dress. To to what again? Dress. Final 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 is dress. Okay. Okay. okay, good, 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 good. Let's, hmm, now, yes, let's listen again and, and, and I help you after. Okay. Okay, let's go. I think I want to wear a dress. Um, you know, I don't think I want to wear a dress. I, I want to uh okay finally is a dress okay and you have only one mysterious word any idea um, mm -mm. no what about the action for dresses for what do dresses? you do with a dress Action for dress. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. Um, what do you do with a dress? Dress. Mm. No idea, right? Put, okay, I I want I want to put a dress. You are guessing because you are using translation google translation yes and that is guessing you okay need to check audio and vocabulary the there is one match for outfit help guys what is the verb for outfit the wear excellent so what is a complete idea noe i don't think i want to wear a dress you are correct I don't think I want ah, okay. to yes. wear, wear. Because you don't put dresses. That's great. So You know? You don't okay. put dresses. You put on. 
This is the correct word. And the other, the other uh, verb or outfit. Wear. Use wear. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. Okay. That's the one. Okay. Let's pass to the next. Mm -mm -mm. Hamil, are you ready, man? Hi, good night. Hello. Okay, let's practice. Where? <clears throat> Action. In those shoes. Um, you know, I don't think I want to wear a dress. Okay. Uh, well, how about a skirt? Okay. Oh. Uh, but. Okay, continue. But um, no, repeat, please. Sure. Want to wear a dress? Okay. Uh, well, how about a skirt? <laughs> okay. Well. Try. Try. Phonetics don't match. Okay, but. But similar situation. Phonetics don't match. Okay, but. But phonetics don't match. Uh, no. Definitely. Final chance. I don't think I want to wear a dress. Okay. Uh, well, how about a skirt? But, but how, how, how are? Okay. I help you. The phonetic how sounds but, correct. But how I like? Eliminate I like. But Hamil, but is not in the video. Oh. The, but the phonetics don't match. Okay. The pronunciation doesn't match with your with but. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But how, yes. How matches. Um. <laughs> anyway, I have a question. Hamilt, what is the expression for options? Or option, think of. Options, not opinion. Ah, option. Yes. Expression for options. For option. Mm. I don't remember. No? Uh, can you repeat, repeat that? Come out. I. I don't ah, remember. Ah, okay. <laughs> Excellent. No, it's bad. No problem. Help everybody. What is the expression for options? How about? Excellent, man. Very good. This expression, I think it's in episode two or three. Um, oh. It's episode okay. two, no? Yes. Or How episode about, uh, probably episode one. Yes, um, David and Gio. Um, David and Gio? David and Gio wa watch the tourist. Oh, really? Yes. How about, how about, you are correct. Expression for options. Ah, okay, no, no, no. Joko, Joko and Liz uh, Joko watch and Liz. Uh, doc documentary. Exactly. Look, Hamilton. Okay. Pronunciation. 
How about? This is the expression for options. Okay. Do you like sushi? No, sushi no. How about tacos? Ah, okay, tacos, yes. How about? Okay. Okay. That's right. So let's go to the next person. Go, um, go, Noe. I like this one. Yeah? No, I don't think I want to wear a dress. Okay. Uh, well, how about a skirt? How about skirt? Okay. Sounds good. Sounds good. Complete the sentence. How about skirt? Uh, pronunciation. How about skirt? Nice. Okay. Okay. Incomplete. Let's listen again. Uh, well, how about a skirt? Well, how about skirt? Pronunciation again. It's not how. Well, okay. Well, how about a skirt? Sounds good. Is a skirt countable or uncountable? A skirt. Ah, perfect. Listen confirmation. Just a second. Yeah. Get it ready. Go. Uh, well, how about a skirt? This is your could speak quickly. Uh -huh. Correct. Before I lost, before I lost the uh, uh, words for the speak quickly. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Anyway, transition complete. Okay. Well, how about a skirt? Correct. Good job. Next. Go, Carmen. I like this one. Mm, I like this one. No problem. Very good. That's correct. I like this one. Continue, Carmen. Okay. Yeah, but it's really old. Uh, but it's really old. Correct. Repeat. But it's really old. Fantastic. Good job. What is the principal information? Um, repeat, please. Sure. Yeah, but it's really old. Oh, my. Is behind? No. Uh -huh. Before? Yes. Give me another, another way to say yes. Another way to say, are you sure? Mm. Mm. I don't know. No. What about the rest? People help expression to say. Yeah. Sure. Exactly. But yeah is affirmation. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. Listen. One, two, three. Huh? But it's real. Well, how about a skirt? I like this one. Yeah, but it's really old. It's only an exclamation, Miriam. Uh, Carmen, sorry. Okay. Very good. Excellent. Let's go to the next. Go, Carlos. That's okay. Try it on. But it's really old. That's okay. Try it on. Oh, it's That's... incomplete. Okay. Again. This one. Yeah. But it's really old. That's okay. Try it on uh, with this blouse and hmm, these boots. That's a game. Again, please. Okay. Let's listen. With this blouse and yeah, but it's really old. That's okay. Try it on. 
uh, with this blouse and hmm, these boots. That's a triumph. That's a what? That's a triumph. The this blouse. Ah, okay, okay, okay. Uh huh. Uh huh. <laughs> uh huh. Yeah, the vocabulary try on. You are talking about a different outfit selecting. Uh huh. Very good. Okay. The blouse. Or the blouse. Exactly. Blows. But pronunciation, Carlos. Blouse. Mm, let's check again. We need to check pronunciation. Look at the color. Let me find you the soundboard. Open no. soundboard. And look at the color, eh? Oops. Mm -hmm. Ow. Okay. Blouse. Right? Exactly. Blouse. That's correct. <laughs> so let's listen again and confirm. Blouse. With this blouse and, hmm. These boots. In this blouse. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Repeat the game, please. That's it. Only three chances. What is the final object that Yoko holds? Both up. What's the name? Boot. Excellent. It's in the vocabulary, brother. Observe. Boot. Exactly. This is the final word. Confirmation. Uh, with this blouse and hmm, these boots. With this blouse, blouse. With this blouse. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. And the final object. No. The final object, the final object that Yoko mentions, the final object that Yoko has in the hands. The final object that Yoko with the blood boot. Aha, exactly. Okay. Yes. Good. Complete the sentence, Luis. On, uh, with this blouse and yes. Okay. Uh, well, how about a skirt? I like this one. Yeah, but it's really old. That's okay. Try it on. Uh, with this blouse and hmm, these boots. Okay, that is, that's okay. Uh -huh. Try on, try on. Ah, okay. Uh -huh. Try on this blues, mm, this boots. Transition again. This bout. No, mm. but. How do you pronounce? How do you pronounce? This, this, and this. The, uh, hmm. If you okay. say, I think the problem is in this color. Listen to this. Mm. This. Aha. Exactly. The second two. Second two. Tease. Uh -uh. 
you're saying this tate tito tu it's not t oh ah okay uh this ah fantastic okay. yes transition everybody one two three this this, this. 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 not this okay this, this and this, this. Exactly. This, this and this. this. <laughs> Let's listen again. With this blues. Mm. Mm -hmm. With this what again? Mm. The, these boots. Before, before that. Okay, yes. Repeat. Okay. This, this blues. Mm -hmm. mm. This what? This what? Uh, this, this blues. Uh, okay, blues this is the music. The this blouse. Ah, that's different. The, the this blouse. Mm. These, these boots. Boots. Eliminate mm. extra information. Okay. Listen again. Okay, this one. Yeah, but it's really old. That's okay. Try it on uh, with this blouse and hmm. These okay. Boots. And these boots. Exactly. Complete. That that's okay. Try on with this this blues and blues is the music. Okay. With this blouse. Excellent. And these boots. Fantastic. Good job. And what, what is mysterious? What is a mysterious word? Exactly. Try on. Try on. No. Try on. Let's uh, help, guys. What is a mysterious word? We are talking about try on. Try on what? When you say try on, you have a specific application. Try on this blouse. Try on these boots. What is the grammatical person corresponding to outfit or blouse, for example? What is the grammatical person corresponding to blouse? It. It. Very good. So, okay. technically, the word is it. Okay. You can separate the word try on. And you can say try. It on. It on. Uh-huh. Okay. Try it on. This is the correct application of trial. Perfect. So everybody, please consider that you can say try on, try my jacket on, or try my glasses on, try, etc. Try it on. Exactly. Or try it on. Uh -huh. okay. Any question? Well, Therefore, you're going to speak quickly for don't listen it. Ah, okay. Uh, this is important. Switch to Spanish. Right. Qué buen comentario acabas de hacer. Sí, cierto. Sí, casi se me olvidaba. Cuando pronuncia Yoko, try on, casi no se escucha el it. But it's really old. With this black. Okay, try it on. Okay, try it on. Okay, try it on. Okay, try. Right? Yes. Sin embargo, van a detectar un pequeño... Ra, 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 ra. Escuchen otra vez. Really old. That's okay. Try it on. Really old. That's okay. Try it on. Escuchan un ron. Yeah. Yes. Right? Okay. Ese era es una T. Cuando los americanos terminan una oración en T. 
y la siguiente palabra empieza con vocal, suenan pronunciar la T como ra. Ra. Por ejemplo, ustedes ya han usado la palabra a lot of. A lot of. Y han escuchado a lot of, right? Es la misma lógica. La palabra empieza en T, el termina en T y la siguiente empieza con vocal. Okay, esto es ahorita sí es como try it on. Try it Pero on, ahí está. Y a ti te salió no se, Yoko. No se, no se percibe muy bien. Y ahorita que me que da la explicación ya se entiende. Claro. Escuchen esto. This blouse, that's one really old. That's okay, try it on. Try it on, everybody, try it on. Try it on. Try it on. With this blouse. Try it on. And these boots. Any question? No questions. Fantastic. So let's pass to the next. Jamil, Hamilt. Uh, with this blouse and hmm. Okay. <laughs> Easy. Oh, uh, with this blouse. This blouse, but the uh, Hamil, this is he this. This blouse. This blouse. Mm -hmm. You see. It's the next. Oh. These boots. Okay. Okay. Easy peasy. That's correct. <laughs> yes. Okay. Okay. And you finished. Good job. Good, good job. Let's practice. Action. That's great. So, what do you have to wear? Well, what do you think of this? I don't know. Put it on. Let's see. Okay, fine. I like it. You look wonderful. Yeah, but it's very dressy. And these high heels are so uncomfortable. But you look great in those shoes. Um, you know, I don't think I want to wear a dress. Okay, uh, well, how about a skirt? I like this one. Yeah, but it's really old. That's okay, try it on. Uh, with this blouse and, hmm, these boots. Okay. All right. Any questions, my people? I think I know, for me. Easy, easy. Excellent. Let's pass to the next. Transition. Let's go That's directly good. to segment three. Hmm. I, I think I like it. Actually, the skirt is really fun. Uh, yeah. It's okay. You don't like it. <laughs> Not really. Uh, those boots are... Sorry, bad idea. I don't have any nice clothes. I think I need to buy a new outfit. Ugh, I hate shopping. Well, listen, maybe I can help. Really? Of course. Uh, I have to meet a friend in about an hour, but I can go shopping with you right now. Oh, that's great! <laughs> What are friends for? <laughs> yes, yes, yes. Shawa, shawa. Shawa, shawa. Shawa, shawa. Very bad, eh? No problem. Vocabulary in shawa, shawa disappears. Let's practice. Eh, Carlos, pronunciation. May. Uh oh, we color. Repetition. Oh, Carlos has disappeared. No problem. Cesar. Good night, Cesar. 
Nice. Excellent, brother. Give me pronunciation, man. Hate. Very good, everybody. Hate. Hate. That's correct. The expression hate is the contrary to the expression love. Like, I don't like. I don't, 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 don't like. Hate. For example, I hate a... I hate... What do I hate? Reggaeton. Hate... Yes, I hate reggaeton. <laughs> <laughs> I hate the bad bunny. <laughs> you hate the bad bunny? <laughs> well, um, oh yes, bad bunny, very bad, eh? Oof. I like bad bunny. But, okay, I, for, for, for the classics. Repeat, repeat, sister. You, what? I hate the Indian. <laughs> What do you mean, India? Indian, oh, no, Hindus. Hindu? <laughs> okay. Well, that's very interesting. We have a lot of Hindus in, in, in Canada. No? Excuse I me? hate a beer. You hate beer? I don't think so. <laughs> I don't think so, you liar. Okay. Interesting. Very good. Carmen, what do you hate? I hate um, vegetables. You hate what? Vegetables. Ah, vegetables. I understand. Vegetables. Yes, no, I guess the pronunciation is important. Vegetables. Yes. Vegetables. Yes, fully vegetables. Only Please vegetables. Exactly. Blah, you know? <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's go. Who, who is yeah. the vegetable? It's new for me. Nah, it's not new. Vegetables like broccoli, carrots. Uh, oh, vegetables. I, vegetables. I hate broccoli. All right. You hate broccoli? Come yes. on. Broccoli is very, very good. Ah, it's broccoli. delicious, the broccoli. Very oh, bad. Thank you, eh? Okay, interesting. Very, very interesting, people. Different, different likes and dislikes. Okay. All right. Let's practice the next transition. Okay, now Carlos, coming back. Can I disculpa, profe, pero se me fue ahí el internet. No problem. No problem. English okay. only. Transition. Any. Exactly, everybody. Any. 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 That's correct. The expression any in this case is any number. Three, because in previous classes, we checked any number one. Mm -hmm. Interesting. Interesting, eh? Uh -huh. In different uh, canvases, you have any number one. In this case, we have any number three. This any is a description for negative existence. Okay. I repeat, it's for negative existence. So we say, I don't have any. Donald doesn't have any money in this moment. Mm. You see? No, que no tiene mm -hmm. nada. In English, the word any is an expression to say nothing. Any is a synonym to nothing in this case. Only any three. Okay. Okay. So for negative existence, we say I don't have any I don't eat any. And here you have an example. Like Carmen. Blah, no vegetables for me. No, I thank don't, you. I don't have any coffee. You don't have any coffee. Me too. Okay. I need an extra coffee. No, no more coffee. Mm -hmm. Another example. In this moment, in this moment, I am in deficit. I don't eat any sugar for the moment. Okay. 
Mm -hmm. So, what about you? What about a uh, Caesar? Do you have a um, Do you have English books? I don't have any book. What book? The Spanish book? Any, no, uh, I don't have any English book. Very good, my brother. Excellent. And what about um, Noe? Do you have Do you have any any sodas in your house? Not sure. I don't have any sodas in my house. Perfect. This is the expression any. Questions? No for me. Fantastic. Now, this is any number three. Okay. Extra point to the person that remembers any number one. Any number one. Run. Take your notes. Any number one. What is the application for any number one? Description for pos possible existence. Description for possible existence. We have an extra point for Luis. Ooh. Good job, my brother. Very, <laughs> very good, my friend. Yes, the word any is over here. Any number one. Let me find it. And here, this is any number one, my people. Description for possible existence. Can you tell me an example, Luis? Um, no. Ah, come on. 50-50 <laughs> point. I know. Ah, come uh, on. Uh, uh, <laughs> <laughs> So what is any number one people who remembers? Yeah, it's uh you have uh, any tomatoes in your house? Oh very good. Yes, yes, yes. That's yeah. a, that's another extra point, eh? Yeah, this is oh. 50 50 teacher. 50 50. Yeah. 50, 50 eh? Yes, five and five. Is are there any? Is there any etc.? Yeah, right. Uh-huh. Only for interrogations. Is, is there any este, a smartphone? Is there any smartphone in the in the house, for example? In the house, okay. And for imagine vegetables. Is there any tomatoes? Are there any tomatoes? Are there any tomatoes? Okay. So any number one is for questions. And any number three is for negatives. Okay. I don't have any. I don't have any beers. I don't have any beers. Uh -huh. It's possible, teacher, it's possible for example that you have any tomatoes in your house. I don't have any tomatoes. Exactly, uh -huh. yes. Uh -huh. It's the same word but the question is different in the affirmation is different in the negative. Okay, okay. I don't have any tomatoes, this is negative. Okay. Excellent example, my brother. Good job. Let's continue. Pronunciation. Uh, Hamil. Actuality. Uh oh, we have actually. Mm. Yeah, actually. Actually. Yes, of course. Actually, actually. everybody, position. Actually. Actually. actually, actually, very good. The word actually actually is an expression. Okay. And actually, is expression for additional information. Additional information. Example. Teacher, you um, are you Mexican teacher? 
Yes, I am Mexican. Actually, I never visited America. Actually, I never visited America. This is interesting. So, okay, you speak English? You speak English, Fernando? Yes, I speak English. Actually, I studied all my life. Okay. What is actually in Spanish? Actualmente. Incorrect. No? Incorrect. Pay attention to the example. I okay. am Mexican. Actually, I never visited America. Ah, uh, okay. Uh, es como... No es también, but no. Also incorrect. Okay. O realmente, ah, o, dice que no es de hecho, o podría ser realmente, o en realidad, o actualmente. Nadie ha dicho de hecho. Yo lo dije hace rato. Yes. Well, sí. You are correct. De hecho. Ok. Ajá. Ok. okay. No, me dijiste actualmente. No, le dije actualmente y después le dije de hecho. Ah, eso no lo escuché. Pero, y si dijiste de hecho, you are correct. Extra Actually, es... <risa> y de hecho en inglés my okay. de hecho exactly Actually. de, de uh -huh. hecho el spot de publicitario de usted hay uno de eh, yo me llamó la atención porque usted dice que Ay, sí, sí, tú. que actually no significa actualmente, actualmente. o actual <risa> Significa y ya, ya da la explicación y eso fue lo que me llamó la atención. ¡Ay, qué padre! Sí, es cierto, en el video dice, ¿sabes que actualmente no se dice actually en inglés? Porque se aparecen Ajá. las palabras, ¡oh yeah! Yes, Jun junto, con, junto con otra palabra que dijo ahí, exacta, o sea, en ese mismo spot, pero no, no recuerdo cuál es la otra. Right, right. Eso se llaman palabras cognados. Los cognados son palabras Ajá. que se parecen a otro idioma. Entonces, es Ajá. actually y actualmente no son, son cognados falsos. Hay otros como like uh, attend y atender. Uh -huh. Atender en inglés se dice assist. Uh -huh. Attend es asistir. Están al revés. Assist and attend. You see? Sí. Etc. You know? So, Be careful y tengan cuidado con las palabras que se parecen. Por eso pongan atención en el ejemplo. I am American. No, I am Mexican. Actually, I never visit the United States in my life. What about eh, Hamil? Give me additional information. Hamil, are you happy? Yes, I am happy. Okay. Actually. 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 actually he's very happy. Ah, for example. Uh -huh. For actually, he's very happy. Who is very happy? Um, in my life? Who? Who is very happy? Um, um, no. <laughs> who? Question who? What is who? Yes. People? Como? Who is not? How is how? 
¿Quién? Who. Ajá, ¿quién? Who is very happy, Camille? Ok. I very happy. Exactly. Incomplete. Very happy is a description. Formula one. I am very happy. Exactly. Complete. Conversation. Hamilt, are you happy? Yes, I am happy. Actuality, very, I am happy. Okay. Organization and pronunciation. Pronunciation. Actually. Ah, perfect. Actually, no actuality. Extra information. Yes, I am happy. Actually, very happy. Excellent. I am very happy. Perfect, brother. That's correct. Very good. We have the word actually. And we have one extra word to finish. Go and away. Bye. Bye, everybody. Pronunciation. Bye. 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 This is a verb. This is a verb for expression. Bye. Bye is the action for the money. You go to the store and you buy groceries. You go to the supermarket and you buy vegetables. Similar page. Similar page. Pronunciation, no page, pay. Similar pay. But it's different. Pay is the action for the money and okay. buy is general. Okay. Oh, it's like general. It's a little different. Okay. okay. Example. Um, Carlos, do you buy at... Home Depot. Mm. Mm. I okay. Uh -huh. Continue. I buy. Uh -huh. I buy. Mm. Home Depot. Okay, very good. What is the connector for location? At. At. So, at. do you buy at Home Depot? Yeah. I buy Home Depot. Connector for Home Depot? At, at Home Depot. Exactly, brother. Complete. Yes. Yes. Buy at Home Depot. Uh oh, person. Yes, I buy. Uh huh. Yes, I buy at Home Depot. Excellent, my brother. Very good. Just as we know, people, attention to Jesse. Jessica is in the chat. Good night. Hello, Hello. Good night, everyone. I will that I will say attendance, please. Is here Carlos? Hello, Carlos. Good night. Good night, Jess. Thank you, Carlos. Hamil. Hi, Hamil. Good night. Hi, good night. Thank you, Hamil. Cesar. Hello, Cesar. Good night. Good night, present. Thank you, Cesar. Uh, Luis. Hi, Luis. Good night. Hi, hi, yes. Good night. Thank you, Noe. Hello, Noe. Oh, yes, I'm here. Thank you, Noe. And Carmen. Hello, Carmen. Good night. Hello, good night. Thank you, Carmen. So, thank you, everyone. Have a good night. You too, Milena. Thank you, guys. Goodbye. Hello. Thank you very much. You're Goodbye. All right. Teacher, for, for example, mm -hmm. I go to Hooters and I buy an and I buy beer. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Wonderful. <laughs> Wonderful example. Okay. Excellent. I go to Hooters and I buy beer. Yes. 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 Next. Transition. Carmen. New. Excellent. Are you ready? Transition. New. Uh oh, but Carmen, look at the pronunciation. New. 
it's not you. Pronunciation, Carmen. Repeat. No. No. Very good, everybody. No. No. Exactly. New. New. Everybody, uh, new no. Everybody new. saying you, and this is incorrect. Listen. New. 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 Exactly. New. new is British and new is American. Okay. Okay. And American people pronounce new. But yeah. I am from British. Yeah, okay. <laughs> so eventually. <laughs> Very good. Okay, okay. You British, you say new. You American, you say new. New. That's right. So Noe, do you have a new customer? Are you there, Noe? Okay, next person. Um, Cesar, do you have a new uh, car? Um, yes, I, I new car. Incomplete. Person, verb complement. Do you have a new car? Yes, I have new car. Perfect. New car is countable. New. Countable. A car. Ah, switch. Is countable. New car is countable. New car. Together. A new car. Perfect, brother. Complete. Yes, I have a new car. Perfect. That's complete, my man. Good, good job. This is your class for today, my people. Do you have any question? No question, teacher. Thank you. Fantastic. Let's finish for the moment. I'll One share question. You oh, yes, Hamilt. Estaría padre que este al momento de que suba la, la, la nueva palabra lo, lo haga como lo está haciendo ahorita con esa descripción de cómo pronunciarlo. Efectivamente. Eh, por está eso, muy, muy buena idea bien. esa. Uh -huh. Sí, está muy para ti. Son... Muy padre. El, cuando... Porque así a nosotros, bueno, a mí en lo personal no se me va a olvidar mañana cómo se pronunciaba. Eso Exacto. esperemos. Ok. Conste, ¿eh? Buena la idea. De... Sí. Uh -huh. okay. <risa> lo tomaré como promesa <risa> dijeron un rato por ahí nada más creen que nos puede enviar el segmento para, para darle una checadita sigue, órale, sí. que ahorita se los mando gracias ¿Va? gracias profe Bye. wonderful Bye. night, I'll see you tomorrow ok, yeah. see you everyone thank you, thank you for Bye, coming guys. Bye. Thank you. Bye. See you. thank you Bye. Guys. Ay, amor, necesitas mucha dedicación.